one let's go they call me johnny appleseed i've come to plant my seeds indeed i've come to plant them in the ground they'll blossom soon for miles around here's a seed planted deep seeds can earn their board and keep <laughs> welcome back to life's a breeze with matt and steve i'm matt this is steve how we doing tonight guys uh, so tonight, uh, I found Bailey's Irish Cream Apple Pie. Apple Pie? Apple Pie. Apple Pie Bailey's? A- apple Pie Bailey's. I've never had this. I think this might be the first year it's out. Um, I've never had this one either. Now, of course, we both remember last year when they, uh, the Valentine's Day. Oh, the strawberry? When always. they tried to pawn that. Oh, no, that was two years ago. Yeah, at least two years ago. Maybe three. Maybe oh, three. Time is flying. But when they when uh, the rep tried to pawn that whole case of strawberry yeah. off on us, well, I did it, and he swiped his card for totally it. Totally so, worked. Yeah. I, yeah, we still got some of that. Uh, <laughs> it's still laying around here somewhere. I got at least three or four bottles yep. of that left. Uh, yeah. Not bad though. No, really, it wasn't. It was a great product. Just kind of no, strange. Nobody nobody knows about it. Nobody knows about it, and we did what we could with it. So now, if you know Bailey's, uh, it's a cream liqueur. Nothing much to it. Uh, oh. Oh, that smells like apple pie. Let's hope so. I'm I'm really excited for this, buddy. I think that's going to be phenomenal. Now, get a good nose on that. Oh, that's... Ooh. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. There's cinnamon and, like, nutmeg yeah. right off the bat. Pum- or uh, apple. Almost like an a la mode flavor, like a vanilla bean. Yep. Oh, yeah. That's killer. That's fantastic. Wow. Oh. That's oh. really nice, guys. I that's, highly recommend that one. That's exactly what it is. You nailed the a la mode. The, the vanilla is in there. It is. It's like a melted ice cream. It is. That uh, Irish cream really comes through. I could not recommend this highly enough. So good. I can't wait to see what we're about to do with this. I could do almost unspeakable things to this. Uh, all right. What are we What are we doing with this? We are gonna We're gonna do some stuff with this. I got a couple ideas. I don't know what you got. I think right. you should come up with some stuff, and I think I'm gonna come up with some stuff. I think we're gonna come back and see you guys, and we're gonna All right. So try some stuff. All right. So hold on. We're gonna grab some stuff. All right. Are you Are you ready? Do you have what you yeah. What you want Want picked out already? All right. Uh, I guess uh, let's do it. So there we go. Uh, all right. I uh, sorry, I swiped this one from you, buddy. It's all uh, good. So my my shot is gonna be these three. Your shot is gonna be these three. Correct. Uh, would you like to start us off? Sure. All right. Uh, all you, right. So I'm gonna go a... to one of my favorites over here. And, oh, you got uh, a glass. All right. As you've seen from other videos, I'm a big fan of the uh, raw vanilla from McGillicuddy's. So I'm going to put a splash of uh, vanilla. Matt loves his McGillicuddy's. Uh, I do. If you, uh, if you get a chance, check out our video. Uh, I'll put the link up here. Uh, that one will have uh, where we put McGillicuddy's head-to-head with some journeymen. That so, was a good episode. Yeah. So then I'm using some Tullamore uh, Cider Cask Whiskey. Okay. With the raw vanilla. And then I'm topping it Ooh. with this. And... I just came up with a completely different idea that I really want to do, so I can't wait till this video is over now. All and right. I can set that up because I just had a total brainstorm. Absolutely. I'm Cheers, excited. guys. All right. So this is how this works. This is how all our great concoctions have come about, sitting right here doing this, but just not on camera usually. It's almost like, a, uh, like an apple horchata. It is exactly like that. I like it. That's what happened. Apple horchata. All right. All right. All right. What you got, Steve? So, I'm going to do a classic. So, this is something that literally anybody on the planet would be able to drink uh, and and enjoy. There's not anybody on the planet who's going to drink this and say, hey, that's too strong. Or, I can't can't do that. And Uh, mind you, this is all liquor. And it's all liquor. And it's, uh, it's strong. It is going to be strong. Um, so first, we're starting with Smirnoff Caramel Kiss Vodka. The uh, best. It is, you know, a lot of people knock Smirnoff, and that's fine. If you're doing any other flavor of vodka, 
total, I totally get it. Yeah, I get uh, behind this one. Caramel Kiss, though, is a hidden gem that Smirnoff keeps up their sleeve. Uh, it is one of the better caramel vodkas I've ever had, uh, and it stacks up to things that are much more expensive. Uh, you'll be happy to know, of course... When we're making uh, drinks in this bar, we use McGillicuddy's. Yes. Uh, we love McGillicuddy's. We just said that. Matt's a big fan. So you'll have... I also the... have a large stock of McGillicuddy's. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> More than anybody I know. More than the liquor store, probably. I mean, and that's, you know, There's years, years ago, you should have seen how much McGillicuddy's <laughs> So I'm doing... Uh, so we started with caramel vodka. Now we're going into butterscotch McGillicuddy's. And then we're going to finish it off with, uh, of course, the Bailey's. Apple. That doesn't need a lot to get a lot of flavor. I'm glad it doesn't need a lot to get a lot. It does not. Yeah, no. That means it's perfect. That's how, how I like my relationships. I've noticed. <laughs> wow. It's, it's coming out of the gate. All right. W- was that not a setup? <laughs> <laughs> Just... <laughs> You don't even know what you meant. Just drink the drink. No, you, sure. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Cheers, guys. Cheers, Jason. <laughs> it's so good. Oh my god. That's good. It's really good. It's really sweet. Yeah. I couldn't do more than one. But as as a one off shot, if I'm at a bar and somebody offers me this and I do it, oh yeah, I am, I am happy all day long. Uh, if I'm at a holiday party, definitely, and somebody has Fall, this at a holiday fest, party, like yeah, St. Pat- ha- Hall- Patrick's Day, St. Uh, Patty's Day, Halloween. Uh, if you do, if you do like we do, and you do a, a half year long St. Patty's Day, so every six months you celebrate St. Patty's Day. That video's coming right you, at you. You're you're right in the zone for that. Otherwise, today is halfway to St. Patrick's Day. Otherwise, um, be sure to uh, do this at all your yeah Thanksgiving parties, Halloween parties, all of it. Absolutely amazing. Which one did you like the best? Um, I really liked yours. I but, did too. But but mine is more approachable to everybody. That's what I will say about it. Anybody could do this. This one. I actually thought uh, yours came off stronger. So see, I don't know if that's okay. It, it came off. It came off stronger in flavor. Mm-hmm. Uh, Just in general. Uh, I think that the whiskey was very predominant in this. I th- I just think you and I don't really notice. But like, okay, say a third party that doesn't drink whiskey ever did your shot. I don't think they would enjoy it as. But much. if they've had horchata, I think that would have been fine. There, whiskey's okay. a big word for people that don't drink whiskey. Is, They're intimidated by it. They and are. They shouldn't be. They're scared. Uh, and, unless you're gonna sit down and drink a quarter of a bottle, like yeah. you can have a little whiskey. Like it's not a big deal. Well. uh... Yeah, I mean, we're... Okay, so you know what? The the fact of the matter is, we have two really good shots in front of I us. Agree. I would make these, either of them, for customers any day. Um, and I think uh, what we're going to do, so stay, stay tuned for this episode. What we're going to do is we're going to get a couple third parties in here. We're going to do a blind taste test between the two shots, and we're going to find... Uh, we're going to narrow down the ultimate fall shot for you guys. But before that... I have a couple more ideas that I'd like to try out. So, oh, absolutely, we're gonna we're gonna come right back and yeah. we're gonna keep keep at it with the with the shots. I hope you're ready, Steve. I'm. <laughs> there's no there's no being ready when you get that look in your eye. Uh, twinkle, twinkle. And plus, like you guys don't see all the bottles he grabbed when we did this segment. Oh, I, that's not even no. what I'm talking about. I thought of something else totally during I know, this video. We, I know. So on top of that, <laughs> you guys only see what we have, which already is a lot. Uh, he's got more tucked away over there, and then he's that got one's gonna be really for good. another another whole set of bottles over here. So stay tuned; it's gonna be uh, a long night. It sounds like 